Welcome back to Make Play Treasure. Today we're reading Lady Pancake, Sir French Toast, The Case of the Stinky Stench by Josh Funk. Back in the kitchen and deep in the fridge past Trifle Tower across Taco Bridge on a vacation at Marshmallow Coast sat Lady Pancake beside Sir French Toast. Knocking down syrup from northern Vermont over the bridge came Inspector Croissants. Uncle Croissant said the fridge is in trouble. A horrible stench turned the whole shelf to rubble. I'm the last hope or the fridge will be lost. Help me or else we'll be cooked, served, and sauce. Nefarious odors began wafting by as French Toast replied, I will certainly try. I've got to succeed, said Croissant with a sob. I've solved zero cases since getting this job. It's Baron Von Waffle, that devious square, said Pancake with anger. Let's head to his lair. They started their search crossing Salsa Ravine and lumbered through smog around Mount Everbean. Slowly they crept to the Onion Ring Cave. Baron Von Waffle said Toast, you old knave. What are you doing here, Waffle said, sneering. I'm sleuthing, Croissant said, and you're interfering. What do you know about smells that are vicious? Nothing, said Waffle. My home smells delicious. Nephew said Toast, Waffle's right. It smells splendid. The trio trudged out, but the case hadn't ended. The smell's getting worse, said Croissant with a shiver, as Tater Tot stumbled through Applesauce River. An okra popped out of a red curry dish and said, There's a tail of a stinky red fish who lurks at the bottom of Corn Chowder Lake. Great, said Croissant, as he tripped by mistake. Rowing their facets with carrot stick oars, they studied the depths and they scanned all the shores. Ahoy, cried Croissant, a red herring right there. At last they'd unravel this stinky affair. They paddled on forward, but as the boat neared, a flavorful smoky aroma appeared. It seemed the red herring was just a bad clue. Dejected, the three didn't know what to do. It's time to give up, Pancake said with remorse. No, said Croissant, I'll discover the source. Inspector Croissant took a mighty big whiff. The odor is coming from Casserole Cliff. Peppers lay slumping and apples were dented. Plumps shrank to prunes and the beans had fermented. That's when they saw it, the source of their woe. A moldy old fruitcake from eight months ago. Someone destroy him, said Pancake, right now. Sure, replied Toast, but I can't fathom how. The fruitcake just cowered, alone looking scared. Life is in all bowls of cherries, he shared. I entered the fridge, but then soon was forgotten. Slowly I crumbled, and now I'm just rotten. This is my crazy case, said Croissant. I'll prevail. Everyone knows fruitcakes never go stale. How would you like being left to decay? There is no villain. Let's help him. Make way. Together they journeyed past Cliff Lake and Cave and offered the fruitcake a shower and shave. Soon the old fruitcake was fresh as could be. What's that delectable smell, asked Miss Free. With all nasty odors destroyed and dissolved, the team celebrated and shouted, Case solved! The end. Hope you enjoyed this cute story. Remember to like and subscribe so you can keep up with our reading events and activities. Catch you next time. Bye!